Surrounded by lush green mountains, Bandarban is a land of natural beauty where clouds float through the peaks. On these mountains, the small indigenous communities live in harmony with nature. But life isn't easy for all of them. Wangnupru Marma is one of them. A physical impairment is no longer a barrier for Wangnupru Marma. We don't have any latrines here. Since there are houses everywhere nearby, we used to go to the peak of that mountain to respond the call of the nature. It's difficult to climb on my knees. My hand hurts severely and sometimes thorns prick my knees. Just climbing it once would drain all my energy. But I had no choice. I couldn't even carry water with me. Day or night, sunshine or rain, I had to go to the mountain. I've lost count of the numbers of times I've slipped and fallen during rainy season. But I don't have to suffer anymore. I can't explain how helpful this latrine is that Water Aid Green Hill has made adjacent to our houses. There's water supply here, an arrangement for washing hands. Before, I had to wait for father to bring water to cook and to take shower. Now, there's water supply in the house. Everything has become convenient. The days of distress are long gone. This one initiative has changed the life of Wang Nupru, who lost her mother at a young age, gradually became physically challenged and dependent. Her old father has got rid of a lot of worries. <laughs> I have taken care of my daughter since she was a kid. Everywhere I went, I used to be very worried for her. Latrine and water supply at the doorstep has eased that. I know wherever I go, she will be fine. Let me show you the latrine. There are 48 families in this small hilly locality. Under the Equity Project, every physically challenged person, like Wang Nu Pru, has been brought to this service. Equity and inclusion is a core principle of water aid. On that backdrop, we began the accessibility audit here and modified our designs according to its findings. We have provided various latrine options based on types of disability. We have also installed various support devices like RAM and handrail and gave importance on availability of water. To do this, we have ensured GFS connection in all of the toilets, making water available. We are two elderly people living in the same house. It's been 20 years my wife cannot see, and she cannot hear for four years. I had to get her water for showering, latrine, and even take her far away for her defecation. One day, I heard some people from Green Hill Water Aid has come to make latrines for physically challenged people. I requested them to make a latrine with water supply for my wife, and they paid heed to my plea. I have forgotten my oaths of the past. My wife can now go to the latrine anytime. Even though she can see, it's not difficult, 
Because the latrine is adjacent to the house, I am grateful to Green Hill Waterway. Their support to the physically challenged people of the village is immense. When we started working in Palikapara, we saw that most houses are of the Machang style and because of it, they cannot have normal latrines at their houses. With this in consideration, we have installed safe water and latrines for their house. We also motivated them to use hygienic latrines and safe water. Hygienic latrine is a right of every citizen. That right for these challenged people of the hill tracks have been established. They don't have to make arduous journeys to go to the latrine anymore. My son is 20 years old. When he was 15, a disease affected his muscles and took away his strength. Since then, I had to do everything for him. I had to give him a shower and take him to the latrine, wash him. It was embarrassing for me and for him too. Since we got the latrine from Green Hill and Water Aid, both of us have been saved from that embarrassment. I cannot tell you how happy I am. I can't see. I have to touch and feel while I walk. We didn't have any latrine close to our house. I used to keep my ears alert and find a place where no one could be heard so I could excrete. A lot of times I had to hold it in. This continued for 10 to 12 years. I feel blessed to have the water supply and Latin. It's heavenly. Life is much easier now. Embarrassment and distress has long gone. The joint endeavor by Green Hill and Water Aid has freed these deprived, physically challenged people from dependence. May this right to equity be established everywhere. <laughs>